Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. Craig at Hiking Pipes, yes, once again. Seems like I'm putting out uh, a video of some kind uh, almost daily at this point. But uh, anyway, a um, couple of things to address. First of all, you can see right there, that's, uh, that's Strider looking out the window. I've been... Um, I've received a few comments in my videos that when I do videos on my front porch here, uh, I get a little bit of a uh, audience, and that I think I think that's Oakley back there. Nope, she's not there. It's just a different reflection. But I have two re rescue dogs, and uh, they uh, always like to look out and see what I'm doing on the front porch. So, uh, just a quick video today. Um, Again, I broke out my Savinelli 320 uh, a little more quickly uh, than I typically would in the rotation. I just like this guy. I felt like it again today. Um, again, this is a uh, smooth grain uh, with green stem. Um, I really, I really like this one. They did a good job. Lots of varying grains. Again, bird's eye on the bottom. Uh, right here in this sec dark section here, but there's some really tight. Uh, tight grain going on in here, um, some uh, little bit of bird's eye with some flame here, just a variety of grains. Uh, this is the sample of the pipe, and I know when you buy a Savinelli, um, you know, model of whatever, you know, that you're going to get variations. Uh, this one I like very much. Anyway, smoking uh, 1855 fourth generation Eric Stoke be in it. All right. Uh, just the purpose of the video is uh, kind of a shout out to the Briar Report. And for those folks that uh, don't know what the Briar Report is, it's basically the Pipe Smokers Online uh, magazine. Uh, Phil is the editor. Phil, I hope I didn't get that title messed up with you. But um, I was rereading an article in the. Oh, there's Oakley. Hi, Oakley, right? Yeah, right there. There she is. Um, but I was rereading an article uh, in The Blob, which is the Briar Report's blog. <laughs> so um, if you followed that one. And uh, something just resonated with me. And uh, that was back on February 18th, there was an article in there, uh, The Blob, that uh, Phil had written regarding... Uh, pipe smoking can save the world, and a uh, pretty good size article. And the thing that really resonated me with me was his the last, almost the last sentence in that article, which uh, basically said to put down the phones and have a pipe, and uh, the world would be a better place. Um, I couldn't agree more with that sentiment. Funny thing is, you know. <sighs> The way we use our phones today, it's a little difficult to do that. Um, I'm making a video on my phone. Uh, you guys will probably watch this video on the phone. I read the Briar Report on my phone. Most of us will read the Briar Report on our phones. Um, yeah, the phones have just become attached to us 24-7 for everything. And, uh, you know... I wish they were. I wish they didn't. Um, you know, some content out there is great. Others, not so much. In fact, a lot of other content out there from a lot of different things, not so much. Excuse me one moment. Mm. Interesting pipe tamper I found. Uh, this is on my porch. Uh, this is from Halloween. It's one of those little mini pumpkin things that, or gourds that you get for, and you put on your front porch for display for Halloween. Well, one of the stems broke off. Look at that thing. Perfect little t pipe tamper. Works well. Light as heck, but uh, that's okay. Works. <laughs> anyway, I digress. I just wanted to thank Phil and let folks know about the Briar Report and the Blob. And uh, basically say, Phil, you're right on. Um, I think we need to enjoy these pipes in the sense of 
that they are relaxing. They're a bonding agent um, for our community. And yeah, let's try to get away from these devices as I'm making it on my device a little bit more. And when we're enjoying our pipes, um, let's get into our own minds and uh, not, uh, not be overly influenced by sitting here reading our phones and, uh, you know, trying to enjoy what these or how these are meant to be enjoyed. Again, one person's opinion, but uh, I'm right with you, Phil. So thanks again. And for you folks, again, please, uh, if you don't know about the Briar Report, go out there, find it. It's briarreport.org. There's a newsletter. And uh, like I said, if you could, you know, get into that uh, magazine, you'll see a link for the blob. And, uh, you know, check it out. Good articles every single day. So with that, thanks again for watching. Be well. Be safe. Let's be good for one another. And again, put down the phones and enjoy the pipe. Take care for now. Bye-bye.